Rocky Road, Dixie boy. Yeah. Are you him? Probably. What kind of question is that? <laughs> ah. <laughs> yeah. Good. All right, Bubba. What's up y'all? We are out on the field. It's a nice little 120 foot throw day. Um, it's a beautiful day outside actually. Look at, look at how beautiful Founders looks. For late fall, it's pretty nice out here. I'm obviously excited that we get to have this beautiful ballpark. Throw on 120 feet. Main goal uh, coming off from last bullpen, which was Monday, today is Wednesday is to focus on the changeup and the cutter. Changeup metrics were a little shaky in the bullpen the other day compared to what I would like them to be. So obviously just getting a feel for that again. And then uh, the cutter metrics were good, but having not thrown it as much as normal, it's kind of just hard to get that release point consistent right now for me. So those are gonna be the two objectives for today. And obviously just keeping it light because we have a bullpen on Friday. So we don't want to throw too far and too hard today. So keep it in that 120 range, but we're gonna warm up. We're throwing with the G-Man today, Garrett. You better rock and roll, Dixie boy. Yeah. Yeah, we gotta do all this, this movement prep, Garrett. I don't want to do it today, but we gotta do it. Warm up, get the body moving. It's a little chilly out. This, this fall weather obviously is uh, better than being home in New York, freaking cold and snow probably right now. So, gotta take advantage of what we got, right G? Never hurry. <laughs> Legs feel good. Getting used to lifting heavier weight again this week, so it's always good. Yo. Ain't nothing but something slight. 120, I'm going 90. You know what I'm saying? Are you him? Huh? Are you him? Bro. What kind of question is that? <laughs> look at how sexy my gloves looks, looks right there. It does look good. Oh. Yes. What do you think your gloves so far? Do you like it? How was that? I just th thought like rip, rip the shoulder. Just yeah, just rip that front shoulder, and then just like yeah. That was good. Does that gyro spin? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, finally figured that, dude, those change ups were good today. Yours were. Yeah. I was just like focused on that front shoulder. I feel like I'm just not, I wasn't getting over the top of it the other day. Yeah. And then today I was just like focused on getting the front shoulder out in front and then just kind of ripping through. Oh, yeah. What we're doing is we're gonna have, you gotta put this one here and then go down there. Under your head. Yeah. 
So what we're doing is this one's gonna pull me forward and then this one's gonna try to collapse my back hit, back hip. So I had to be strong in the foot, keep my back leg stacked and also try to use the slope to my advantage still without basically like collapsing. Oh. I know, dude, it's a lot better than what it was before when I first started getting back on the, the mound. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Core Velo Day. Yeah. All right, y'all. It's bullpen day. We've got the moose man catching the pen. First time hitters can stand in today, so I think Tippett's coming to stand in. I'm pretty sure um, he switch hitter, so he'll be both sides. Get ready to throw off this uh, beautiful mound right here. Got the track man set up today. I'm glad Current set it up, so I totally forgot. Merry Christmas. Hey, Merry Christmas. Pad. Happy New Year, Pad. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta click the red button. I got it. Here. Oh, you just want to look? All right, Bubba. Uh, yeah. The curveball that you threw, like, don't try to be too fine with that fastball. Okay. Like, don't try to, like, I gotta get the black. Do the curveball, like, the shit. Just there. Yeah. Yep. Good. All right. that miss all day. He's gonna call side to side. All right. Okay. He's, he's, gonna call, he's gonna call location side to side. Okay. But he's gonna sit on the plate. All right, I like okay. it. Yeah. No, no, no. But, but you can't miss off the plate. Everything, if you miss, it's over the plate, up or down. All right. Okay. okay. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that was good. That was my best one today. Good. That was really good. Just that sweeper. I just gotta get it up front. Yeah. I think it's just because I haven't thrown it like to lefties. Yeah. 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 I just gotta stay more center. Can you throw fastball? Down and then I, I couldn't tell. It was like, fast. But like when you would throw a fastball, it would back up. Yeah. Yeah, most of my fastballs were. I feel like they were. No. But some of them, when you started. Yeah, when I missed away, away, like out of the zone, it was this. But start into me, they would tail a little bit. Yeah. All right, y'all. It's a couple days later, but the bullpen the other day went really solid. I was 90-92, super low release height. I think it was around like 4.5 to 4.7, which is honestly better than what it was before uh, surgery. I had around 19 to like 23 inches of vertical movement on the fastball, which is really good. Curveball was really good as well. Sweeper was okay. Um, I was just kind of leaving it backed up a little bit. I also haven't really thrown it to lefties yet, and I just started throwing it as well, so I'm not extremely confident throwing it to lefties yet, but that'll come with time. Everything else felt good though. 
I only threw one cutter. Uh, the changeup felt really good and was around the zone a lot, which is which is good as well. So I was super excited with how it went. And velocity was there as well for um, being a, a bullpen as well. So the only thing that really wasn't great about it was just my arm side misses. Um, I had a couple um, on some off-speed stuff, and uh, the hitter said that they could easily pick it up when I would leave it arm side, which it's only the first bullpen with a hitter standing in, so it's nothing crazy to worry about. But when I'm on the plate, basically up and down, um, my stuff is really, really good. So the biggest thing for me now is just keeping everything on the plate or just off the plate and moving up and down uh, primarily and then also trying to work horizontally a little bit. But if I miss <clears throat> middle of the plate and it's either up and down I probably will get away with it with the way that my fastball plays just those arm side misses I'll put them in over this clip of me talking but you can kind of see just the fastball doesn't really have the same amount of life on it and the off-speed stuff it just kind of comes out of my hand differently than what it does when it's on the plate so just cleaning that up one more bullpen left before we face actual hitters on Friday the 15th and then the 16th I'm going home for winter break um, and then I'll throw live a couple times at home as well. But I'm super excited. We're really, really close. We're like four days away from throwing to hitters. So I'm super pumped, man. It's been a long process, and this is like basically f the final stage. We're in we're in the home stretch. So I'm super pumped with how progress is going. Everything's feeling good. Body, arm, mental space, all that stuff. And I'm super excited just to be able to go out there and compete again. Um, it's been a long time. So counting down the days, but. That's going to be it for this video, guys. Hopefully, y'all did enjoy. If you did, be sure to leave a like down below. Also, if you're new to the channel, be sure you subscribe. And if you haven't, be sure to click that little bell down below as well so y'all can get notified every single time I upload new content. I will see y'all next week. Big video next week. We're finally throwing to hitters. I'm super pumped. I hope y'all are too, and I'm looking forward to y'all getting to watch that. So it's been a long time coming, and I'm super pumped. But I will see y'all next week. Stay tuned. Super big video. Yeah, y'all. Peace out.